low height as Scott Sandlin continues to shuffle his troops in the first half of this season. Thanks for being with us here on Friday night. Zach Schneider, Judd Met. Side, James with a shot blocked in front by Booyum. Back to James with 10 seconds to go. He walks into the circle, now to the middle, he scores! Dominic James! Well, UMD did a great job here moving this puck, but they had everything out on the perimeter that whole time until this play right here. You can see James brings it to the middle, takes it to the middle, down the Royal Road, right to the... UMD, they cashed in late in their first opportunity. Dominic James, the other unit out there to start this one. Far side, a shot, he scores! Ben Steves, the freshman, continues his hot streak. It's 2-0, UMD. Ben Steves gets a pass from Isaac Hauer. Watch how quickly he shoots his puck. I mean, it wasn't a big wind-up, a big slap shot one-timer, but how quickly he snapped that puck off was unbelievable. And again, penetrating through the middle of the ice here. Great job by Howard to draw attention and finds a seam through the middle and just a little... Was blocked off by Dubinsky, again off the end wall, out in front it came. Rizzo digs it free, centering pass for Dornbach to the far side. Divide a one-timer, that was off the crossbar, no goal signal. We continue on. They might go, MD will get a change, all four of its killers off the ice, but Krona moves it ahead quickly to Rizzo. At the line, tried to sidestep Gallatin. Rizzo still with it to the middle, he scores! Massimo Rizzo, a power play goal, the lead is two to one. Well, <clears throat> pretty tough play here. Owen Gallatin gets caught on the wrong side. You can see right there, instead of staying on that defensive side, he tries to go for the hit there instead. Cross. The blue line back on the attack. Bros now behind the net. Rizzo to the far side, off the pit. Far side it was Bros, and I think that caught Thiessen. Not sure what it hit, but Bros had a lot of net to shoot. Will wrap it around the boards. He can't get it past Rizzo at the far side. To the point, Boo Yum. Scramble on now for the penalty kill. To the far side, one timer. Great save from Thiessen as he went right to left. Boo Yum holds for Denver with 45 seconds to go. Seconds to go in that. Minor to Quinn Olson. He's released and we're back to five on five. Divine into the circle. Centerina, shot, they score. Carter Mazer right in front. It's an even strength goal. We're tied two to two. Breakdown there. And it's a three on three. There's nothing happening here. But watch UMD gets mesmerized by the puck. And Jesse Jocks, unfortunately, I'm going to pick on him a little bit here. But he just kind of. These two teams both average over 30 shots on goal a game. Long shot here for the Bulldogs. That hit bodies, bounces to the far side. Steve's in the back end to the far side. They score! Dominic James, his second of the game. U Steve's in low height. You'll see UMD does a nice job. They go low to high, back to the D, then crash the net. It's Steve's who makes the play here, picks that puck up on his back end and throws it toward the net on the weak side. You see James just parked up front and has a wide open net. Award, and we'll get a decision now from our officials. After you, the challenge is successful, there's no goal. It is indeed goaltender interference, and we... Kaiser now, back to the point, it's Gallatin. Final 60 seconds of regulation. Kaiser, across for James. James walks in, a shot. Krona makes the save. Jacques was in front of the goal, and he and one of the pioneers, that's Barons. It's one on two across the red line. Tried to get it in deep, it's taken away by Benning. Two on two, they cross the line. Benning drops it there for right. In the middle, one timer shot, they score. Tristan Bros, the game winner for Den. Well, it was Denver that jumped on a turnover in the neutral zone. Isaac Howard, kind of late in the shift, tries to beat a guy one on two. And turns it over and Den